war. Ooh, we might, and they might have information on whatever the heck is going on with. Exactly. With me. <laughs> Possibly. <laughs> they they have history. They might be able to tell me. Is this a your just sneaky way of trying to get us to go to the museum? Not at all. Not at all. Hmm, I don't know if I trust you. Plot. 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 Definitely plot. Hmm. I I did a perception or decept. Wait, is it? That's for, let me do a deception check real quick then. <laughs> I don't know if I trust. I got a fourteen on it. So because mine my my charisma is a negative one. I don't think I trust Dante. He wants me to, and I'm like air quotations learn. Learn. <laughs> <laughs> I don't Learn know if about I can trust curing that. you? I don't know if I can trust that. I've, I've never trusted a man who wanted me to learn anything before. Hmm. If, hmm. if he can, if there is something there, it'd be one more lead than we had before, that which is isn't a, good point. a lot. That's a good point. I will agree. We'll have a lead. Yes. Deal right. time. Time to learn. All right, uh, I'll be right back. Uh, food's at the door. Okay. So you guys make your way back to your rooms. Octavian, you pop out Gus Gus, or you can feed him through your eye holes. Your choice. Now nah, I'm gonna take my head off and shake him out of my skull. All right, he not gonna, shake, shake like, him. I'm not gonna try to shake him. I'm just gonna plop him out. He plops on the bed. Him. Yeah. He's him. Yes. Look, come come out of my skull. I have cheese and crackers. He begins to voraciously eat the cheese and crackers. Mm, yeah, move good, good. So I'll put my head back on. You can stay outside. Uh, I my just realized for a while. we haven't fed him in like a day. We haven't. He's probably famished. Oh, look at him! I'm gonna give him some water. You don't have to live in my skull anymore, buddy. You can stay out if you want. You I will just, use like, my. You know, yeah. Just you know, like, don't let him wander around the ship. Oh, you can put, no, him, the, you can put him in the bag of holding. No, he'll run out of air. I know. <laughs> it's horrible. <laughs> um, I will. I'm gonna let him. I'm um, just stay in this room, okay, buddy? Okay. Do I want to roll an animal handling check? Make an animal handling check. Okay, here we go. Oh, that's pretty good. That's a fifteen. That's strong. Right. Uh, Gus Gus looks at you, and you get the idea that he gets the the point across. Okay, buddy. Does he Just... tap his little hand? He oh. taps it once. Oh, okay, buddy. Good job. Oh, so smart. So smart. And we'll be sure to bring you plenty of cheese and, and crackers. crackers. And maybe some grapes. And, like, do you like grain? Would you like some fine grain? Maybe some bread? He taps once do, for yes. Do mice eat meat? They can. Mice are omnivores, but they usually eat, like, bug real Let's meat. see if I can... I'll try to see if I can find you some bugs, buddy. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe we can... Hugo, I have a question. Yes. Could we build Gus Gus a sort of, like, mechanized suit that would allow him to come into battle with us? Hey, guys, question. Like the hamster from... I think yes. that would take me a couple of months. If we were to merge Gus Gus and Sphere together, would it be the hamster guy from... Yes, they really uh, would. From Overwatch. Yeah, from Overwatch. Pretty much. And then once you awaken him, it really will yes, be the hamster. Yes, it would be. <laughs> okay, I do have a question. Yes. What are yes. the chances of us actually being attacked by Sky Pirates? Oh, yeah. Are Sky Pirates a thing? The caption kind of... You, we, I'll say you guys head back up to the, the deck, top deck, and the captain is at the helm with his with his first mate, and he, he kind of dissuades you and says, Sky Pirates aren't going to be a problem. The route we take is heavily trafficked by other much... What's the word I'm looking for? Heavily armed ships. But but that's they, what they want you to think. They Well, it, it, there's a slight possibility, but I'm saying like a, a 1% from a 99%. Mm, but there's still a 1%. He goes, yes, but we should be fine. Cool. All right, fine, I guess so. It's going to be boring. <laughs> okay, I'm, so <laughs> I'm sorry, but, like, 
my headphones cut out for a little bit, so it just sort of sounded like you went, ah. <laughs> 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 Okay. So, Octavian heard there's a chance of Sky Pirates, so he just went, ah. Yeah. No. He got shot. <laughs> All right. So, as the rest of the day progresses, as you guys... You do feel the ship descend to a, a lighter altitude, or a... a, a bleh, descend to a lower altitude. And those of you brave enough to peek over the edge, you do start to see ground, some grassy fields, uh, small patches Mars, of trees. Mars, we're falling out of the sky! <laughs> Octavian! <laughs> we're plummeting towards the earth! At an alarming rate. Mars is just on the bed holding up. <laughs> you should literally just put him in the bag of holding like we talked about earlier. I am not some sort of... Well, actually, yes. Now that Gus Gus is out, I don't no! have to feel guilt. You exactly. motherfuckers! <laughs> 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 it was all part of the plan. But the first day progresses. You guys retire to... As the night begins to emerge, you guys retire to your rooms. And you all get a long rest. Excellent. And as you wake up in the morning, you do hear the activity of the crew. Shouting and uh, adjusting sails. Messing with the mechanism that keeps the ship afloat. And as you, as you head to the top deck, you can see that you're quite low. You're not touching the ground, but you're maybe... Why are we so low? 200 feet off the ground. If I wanted a cart, if I... Uh, I would have got a normal ship if I wanted to be this far down. The captain kind of sees you and he approaches and he says, We only go this low for a little while. Then we'll climb back up to the higher altitudes. But this way we can avoid anything. Dragons? Are there dragons up there? Yeah, are there dragons? He goes, yes! There are dragons. We oh, have cool. The territory we're in now, we have to be careful of that. But that's why we fly so low. Oh. And we don't carry any gold. And oh, you know, to attract a dragon. I have gold. <laughs> you kind of see his face kind of sink a little bit. And he says, don't say that out loud. I have... Uh, Octavian. Gold, Octavian. Golden Octavian. coins! Octavian. Gold, uh, chocolate <laughs> coins! Chocolate Octavian. gold coins! They're not real! They're I just fake... Silent. <laughs> they're fake. They're fake coins made of chocolate. I cast that, uh, on him. Everyone knows chocolate's poisonous. To... <laughs> <laughs> Is there a safer silence or? No, uh, it just happens. Let's see. <laughs> I'm just. I'm... <laughs> yeah, it just happens. It just happens. It just happens. Oh God! You all watch as Octavian oh, <laughs> begins to ramble on before suddenly falling quiet. His mouth continues to move. But nothing emerges. He can't see his mouth, remember? Oh, he can't see his mouth. He's wearing a mask. So, sure, for some reason, Octavian... The movement of his, like, whatever he's wearing. Like, yeah, I'm he's, making very... Yeah, he's, I'm making very... I'm, I'm a very gesture He's a mime person. now. He's speaking yeah, with yeah, his... Yeah, he's, he's speaking with his hands, but nothing's coming out. <laughs> I always Wait, speak with my hands. <laughs> Wait, Dante, if you could do that this entire time... What? They do it so many times a day. Okay, hmm. do you see how re this was going to be the more dangerous situation? I felt was best to use it in. Okay, I wasn't trying to fight a dragon right now. I'm gonna walk out of the silence bubble. Hey guys, hmm, maybe it was like altitude sickness or something, but it got really quiet right over there. <laughs> 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 I don't know how this guy works. I'm almost af as afraid of dragons as I am of heights because they fly. Well, some dragons are fun. Yeah, some dragons are nice, like but gold like gold dragons and silver dragons, just and like, copper dragons, and bronze dragons. But just like a creature that big should not be able to fly. Why not? It's unnatural. I don't think it's unnatural. You know, I think it's, it's unnatural. beautiful. What? Don't, don't Your say friend. it. Right I'm there very in front natural. Of you. I'm very natural. He's very yeah. natural. You could say he's very all natural. Yeah, I'm That's very true. all natural. In a way, he is very all natural. I'm going to walk up to Dante and be like, technically, from a technical standpoint, you're exactly like me. You just have a little bit more padding around yourself than I do. 
but I also have a brain. I have a brain. It's Do a you? mouse. Just in a rat. <laughs> you took him out. I did take him out. That's right. I'm <laughs> so you don't have a brain anymore. <laughs> um, I didn't have him to begin with. It's a metaphysical mind. It's more like an idea of a head, of a thought, of a brain. <laughs> <laughs> How do you know you're human? I know that I'm human because Ow. I can do this and I will pull my thumb off. See? See? Human. I will put my Magician's thumb back on. trick pulling the thumb off. Yeah, yeah. pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> really pulling his thumb off. <laughs> I can tell that I'm human because of the bone structure of my skull. How do you know you're not inhabiting the same someone's bone structure? structure? How what? How do you know you're not inhabiting someone's skull then? Like a ghost. Oh, you mean like, oh, I could be a ghost. I never thought of it like that. Hmm. I could be a ghost possessing you a skeleton. Be also nah. projecting your body into, or your spirit into another being. No, nah, this is be. definitely Octavian's skeleton, because one time he got hit in the back of the head by a beer, by a, <laughs> a beer mug, and it cracked his skull. And there's a crack right where it was on, his, on the back of his skull. <laughs> it feels know the weird. anatomy of skulls? What? Do you know the anatomy of skulls? Most skulls have cracks. Yeah, but this one's in the shape of a beer tankard, right? That's what Octavia, oh, that's what Mars told me when it happened. I also have this, and I'll show, like, part of my bone where there's, like, a very visible bite mark. This is when I was attacked by wolves. <laughs> Why do you have, when did that happen? This was when I was a human. You don't remember that time we were out in the woods and the wolves attacked us? And, my and they like, bit all the Yeah, hips. they bit all the... You don't remember... Well, I mean, you did heal me pretty soon after, so you probably didn't see how deep they bit me. But they got me down to the boat. You know how dogs are. They go for the skeleton. Jesus. Yeah. I still fear them to this day. More, not more, you know, now more than ever, being that I am, in fact, you know... So you're just saying I can't have a pet dog. You can have a pet dog, but you need to teach them respect. Obviously. Yes. As long as you respect them. Yes. I do have a question, uh, Dante. <laughs> yeah. Does your kind uh, lay their eggs on a beach and then leave and then wait for their children to hatch just for them to run frantically to the ocean uh, while so, being, being attacked by bird by being, so, being attacked by okay. Aracocra? <laughs> <laughs> that actually depends on which subrace you ask. Oh, okay. If you ask the tropical, the ones mm. who... The, the ones that live in the ocean? Yeah, well, the turtles who live in tropical areas, they do oh. that. Okay. They're also mostly the nomadic, the nomadic kind that does that. Because uh. they have... Uh... Hang on. I gotta, I gotta deafen for a second. There's somebody sure. at my door. Okay. So, is you're the kind that wears your babies as a hat? Yes. Ah, uh, yes, of course. I, I was sense. on... I, it was very fun writing my parents... Uh, my master's uh, head for a while, wow. but then I was very quickly taught the ways of martial arts. Of the ninja. from from the top of his head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was watching my older brothers for the longest time. Wow, mm -hmm. what a beautiful! You probably had a great vantage point from all the way up there. Not really. No, really. He was very short. Oh. <laughs> hmm. hmm. The brothers were much taller. <laughs> Fascinating. Hello. I'm back. Okay. What are you talking about? We're talking about how his species of turtle wears their babies as hats. Aw. That's yes. cute. Just an odd custom. Hmm. But again, I was raised well, I mean, by more of a giant rat than a turtle. Oh. That's right, I forgot. Yeah. He did let me sit on his head every now and then as a baby, but then soon after that, I was weaned off of it and started running around and hiding in the shadows. You began suckling on the teeth of martial arts, is that yes. correct? Of the ninja way. <laughs> of the ninja way. <laughs> of the ninja way. <laughs> the big, the big, the, the big jiggly titties of the ninja way. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> ah, yes, the ninja titties. <laughs> the ninja titties. <laughs> like, like, any good weeb. <laughs> like, <yes. laughs> like any good weeb. Like any good weeb, boo. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> All right, Mar Arcade is gonna throw himself off the boat. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> that's, that's, 
<laughs> All right. Um, That's the theory if he shatters or not. Yeah. No. Um, so while we're flying this low, um, are we like, uh, like, how close to the ground are we? You're about 200 feet up in the air. Okay, so we're still pretty high up. Yeah, yeah. you're not touching the ground. You're just okay. a lot lower comparison. Comparing Okay. Them. All right. Can we see anything from the ground? Like villages and things like that? Make a perception check. Perception. 17. 17. You do see a village approaching, but it looks like you're just going to pass over it and continue on. Okay. I just wanted to see if there was any just watching the village from the distance is all. Hmm. Mars, you know what I know what I'm happy about right now? What? Octavian doesn't have a physical body for the most part. I do. See? Okay, Look. and he can't be off the boat. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Not that I would want to. You would. <laughs> Don't lie to us. You would wait until we're right over the village and then you'd pee off the side. Exactly. I'm not a monster. You literally scarred a child. I'd poop off the boat. <laughs> <laughs> You'd make me hold on to you to make sure you don't fall out the window. Yeah, I would, I would. Sweet. I'm gonna go up to the captain. Captain, I have a proposition. <laughs> no. Ignore I, him, Captain. Your men seem very, you know, bored, and I myself am an entertainer. Would you care for me to rouse them with some jaunty tunes and some sailor tunes? He goes, if you're a performer, my man would be happy to sit a, sit a while and listen. Ah, yes. I will perform the, the greatest uh, performances I can possibly muster up. I will go to the middle of the main deck. And I'm free. Softly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to, um, let's see here, um, hmm, what do I have on my person? Does anyone have a bow staff or a pole that I can use? I do not. Hmm. No. Does anyone have a broomstick? Uh, you do see one of the crew members holding a mop. Um, do you by any chance have any extra poles for the mop? Uh, the, the guy kind of looks at you and says, I, I guess. I would need one. If you could also douse, if you could cover the two tips of the poles with, uh, with, with uh, rags covered in kerosene, that'd be great. Don't start a fire. Are you going to try and do fire dancing again yes no. i am the last time you did that you set your hair on fire well i don't have to worry about that now you set my robe on fire well then don't be near me don't set the <laughs> ship on fire i won't i promise i'm quite skilled in it i think you're lying to me i well you'd probably be false uh, i don't quite know <laughs> <laughs> if you're being <laughs> if you're trying to be dishonest you can make a deception check i'm no. just I'm not really don't, being dis. Don't let him do it. Don't. Please, no. please. I'm not I... twenty for perception. It'd be insight. For perception and what? But, It'd oh, be insight. insight. Yes. Okay. <laughs> but uh, Octavian, 18. I got a twenty. Damn. <laughs> mm. I can't get below a twenty in deception. Damn. <sighs> All right. But, I'm no going to get the pole. Don't wrap the don't. tips. Don't. Dip them in kerosene, light them on Don't fire. Them kerosene. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the magical, marvelous show of Octavian. I yeet, I yeet the, the, the mop pole off of the boat. <laughs> Make, stre Make a strength check. Bye -bye. <laughs> Octavian, make a counter strength check to see if you can hold on to the pole. Cool. I'll hold on to the pole. <laughs> no. What did you get? I got a uh, uh, a twelve. I got a seventeen. You, <laughs> I'm not letting go of the pole, so you can throw it off, but I'll still be connected. Mars, you, like... you grab the pole and begin dragging Octavian to the edge of the ship. Fine, I'll do another performance. Gosh, damn! Uh, you're the, you're I'll go the back captain. to the middle. 
You hear the captain shouting, that's not what I had in mind. Fine, I'll do something better. I'll do this, and I will uh, begin performing some sort of magical tricks. All right, before I will, I will, all right, come one, come all. I will show you some of the most grandest magic you have ever seen. I walk Feats over to the captain and Feats say, of arcane. Don't let him have rags and poles or anything flammable. Make sure your crew knows this. I will show you magic the world has never seen before. I will lie to you and you will believe me. <laughs> you see a small crowd is gathered. Of the, the, oh the, sailors seem, the sailors seem to congregate around you. You do feel the ship kind of lurch and stop as no one's manning it, but they do surround you. All right, everyone, prepare yourselves for some of the greatest feats of entertainment. I, all right, I will um, use prestidigitation to, um, I will make it look like my, uh, okay, I'm going to make, like, confetti shoot out of my wrist from my, okay. from my shirt. All right, everyone, so tell me. Does anyone need? Hmm. Let me... I don't know. Really know. Let, let me think of my thing. All right. I will. I will. I will put my hands together, and I will be like, "So, have you ever seen someone remove their thumb before?" And I will do like the very simple kind of magic trick where you look like you pull your thumb off. You see at the front of the crowd, Alphonse and the small child, just kind of wide-eyed watching. I said, "Oh, if you think that was impressive, watch this." And then I will proceed to pull my actual hand off. It's still in the glove. It's still in the glove, though. <laughs> you, the, the the kid and Alphonse kind of recoil. The rest of the crowd kind of starts laughing and cheering. Marvelous, is it not? I will place it back on. But what about this? And I will I will then proceed to pull. Um, I will pull, I will pull each finger off and place them back on. Um, I will then say, well, most people don't really think. Most people think that I'm quite of a fake person. But I assure you, the only thing fake. The only fake thing about me is this, and I will dislocate my leg, and I will throw it onto the ground. This is the only fake thing about me, and I will place it back on myself. The crowd um, is... Make a performance check at this point. Okay. Oh, ooh, okay. That's a 19. 19. Uh, the crowd is just enraptured by you. You can even see the captain from up by the helm, just kind of leaning, just kind of staring at you from a distance. If you think that was impressive, watch this. I will pull my head off, twirl it in my hands, kind of like spin it on my fingertips, and then uh, place it back down onto my, um, uh, onto my shoulders. <laughs> impressive, no? They, you, they start clapping and... And a, and a few of them take out bronze or copper coins and tossing them at you. Yay! You make you about me. you make about six copper. Ah yes, thank you very very much. I will be here for the duration of the of the voyage. <laughs> yes. Um, I could I guess if you well, and then I guess I'll just take like a little seat and I will begin strumming and playing my uh, my lyre. <laughs> All right. Yes. For the rest of the entertainment process. The crowd begins to disperse, getting back to their work as you strum and let the chords kind of float around them. And unfortunately, that's where we're going to have to end for tonight. Okay. okay. That's fine.